Governor Bassani today met with heads of security agencies to articulate new approach to tackle Kaduna bandits and other criminals. The governor told journalists shortly after the closed-door meeting in Kaduna that his major concern remained the safety and welfare of the people. One of the most important uh, agenda in our manifesto is the safety of our citizens, and that is the reason why uh, we believe it is very important to look at the security situations in the United now. And I'm quite impressed by the effort of all the security agencies, including the, the police, the DSS, the Army, the Air Force, uh, the Navy, and all the security heads. They've been doing very well, and I'm also happy with the level of their coordination. So, so far, so good. We have looked at the situation generally as it affects the citizen. And of course, uh, like I said, we are going to maintain the momentum. Uh, we support them. But uh, one of the most important areas we discuss is trying to engage the general public. Because we believe uh, security is the role and resource of every citizen of the state. As part of efforts to enhance mutual trust and community based engagement between security agencies and local communities to end conflict and crisis in Kaduna State, the Global Peace Development and International Alert have engaged traditional leaders, security agencies, and critical stakeholders on civil and human rights standards. Increase enforcement of human rights standard in, in policing, which will support in the review and reform of some of these security agencies' policies, plans, and programs. Part of the rationale for this joint workshop is to improve security agencies' community engagement strategy, build relationship with the communities, build capacity of security personnel for improved civil approaches to human security and protections of civilians. From the statistics we've gotten in these few days in the field, we found that insecurity is persistent and it's cut across many elements, drug use, uh, rape and all other elements of insecurity including banditry and as well kidnapping. So for me, we have been able to bridge the gap, particularly in the planning process where coordination and the engagement between the civil society, which is international alert and global peace, and on the government part, Cardinal Peace Commission, whom the security agency is well um, created and so with that synergy created, we'll be able to get more information that we can use to stabilize the conflict. Security agents present uh, the early warning, said that early warning sign is a good approach to reducing conflict in the society. Also speaking, the village head of Maraban Rido in Chikong local government, Autaganyi, said the workshop was timely and apt. Always good to observe the early warning signal so that we'll be able to tackle crisis. Even in your family, if you see your child moving around with bad friends, if you tackle it on time, it will save you a lot. If you allow him, the next thing, India him smoking. The next thing, cultism. The next thing, arm robber. You understand what I'm saying? In even this early warning signal start from the home to the larger community. It's about us looking holistically about the crisis that is prone in Kaduna and in Zamfara State and the ways that all of us, when we join forces, we should be able to nip the crisis on the board. And by this, contribution of NDLA, contribution of police, civil defense, the military, the civil societies, and every other person. Sometimes we cannot sleep because of a kidnapping issue. But uh, we thanks because security agents, something like a police and the soldiers, they are giving us support, most especially uh, government help us with an uh, outpost there. And that outpost, they are helping us. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.